Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name's Lily. And today uh, we're going to be doing another calendar unboxing. It's not an advent calendar, it is a New Year's Eve countdown calendar. Um, and I'm very excited about this. So I, well, <laughs> I've never really seen um, New Year countdown calendars before. So that was really exciting anyway, because you get like typical advent calendars with like the 24 or 25 days. Um, but so I've never really seen one counting down to New Year's Day. Today we're going to be unboxing the Aldi uh, Beauty New Year's Countdown Calendar. Um, and if you don't know, Aldi are basically, I think they're based in Europe, I think it's like a European thing. If you have Aldi in like America or other places, please let me know because I genuinely don't know. But it's really big in the UK, there's literally one everywhere, um, there's one down the road from me. And they do everything. It's a food like supermarket, but they also have these middle aisles that change like every week. That literally have like well, currently there's like the Christmas decorations there. They also have like hardware stuff. They have homeware, um, kitchen, literally anything. Like it's amazing. Baby stuff, um, all types of different food, and then like washing up stuff. Li literally, they sell everything. It's amazing, um, and it's super affordable. Um, they also are known for doing um, knockoffs of stuff. Um, so like they'll a brand will bring out something and then Aldi will do something because Aldi have their own like skincare beauty range and it's it's called La Cura. I'll put it on the screen because I'm not sure if that's right, but I think that's right. Um, and it's basically their own brand of makeup and beauty products. So yeah, this is a uh, New Year beauty countdown calendar, um, and I am going to stop my rambling <laughs> so we can get right into this video. <laughs> So this is, I'll show you, this is the countdown calendar uh, from Aldi. <laughs> um, I saw it the other day and I was like, this is really cool. This retails for £15, um, I think it's £14.99. So I was like, yeah, that's very affordable, 15 quid for a calendar. Um, and it's got, I've just looked, it tells you what's on the back. Um, I haven't had a proper look, but I can, at a glance, I can see there's like six things in here. So there's going to be six doors in here. So this is what it looks like. It's really pretty. It's standard like cardboard advent calendar. It's smaller than most advent calendars because obviously it's only like six doors. Um, it's got beauty in it. I think it's just skincare. Um, and it's basically a purple box. It's got like firework animation on the front. Um, and it's really cool. And then you've got this little slide off tab um, in the middle, which I'm going to slide off now. So you slide that tab off the front. It's like when you have like a, a microwave meal and you slide the thing off so you can peel the film back. Um, that's what it is. So it's really nice purple and black kind of, it's not holographic, but it's very shiny cardboard on the front with really nice little fireworks on as well. And it opens, it opens like um, a book. So we have these two sides. It opens like a book. You have these two sides that are in the middle. You pop those open and it is like a little book or it's like one of those um, beauty mirrors that has like the three mirrors in one. It's like you, you stand it up and you've got like the big mirror in the middle then two on the side or has that just made it more confusing? I'm sorry, I don't know. But the inside you have the dates and you have, um, it's the same really nice deep purple packaging and then we've got some gold um, little dots and stars just on the inside of the packaging and then we've got doors uh, from door number 26 to the 31st um, which isn't really the new year that's new year's eve but I'm but okay um yeah so we have 26 to 31 and then on either side of the doors it says a little treat each day on your countdown to new year um and I really like this. I think it's a really cute thing to have. Literally, you can give it to someone as a Christmas present because it starts on the 26th. So if you it's if you don't know what to get someone for Christmas, like this is 15 quid. So if it's any good, if it's any good, get your hands on it because it's only 15 quid and because they rotate their stock really regularly, regularly, regular, a lot. Um, 
<laughs> yeah, so it, it might like go pretty quick as well and then it might not come back. But I'm hoping this will be in stores for a while because if it's good and you can pick it up. So we are going to get right into this and start um, at number 26. So this is um, here. 26 the letters on the doors are in just like really nice gold writing but i'm noticing the font is different on like each number seems to have a different font on um like some's quite like fancy uh scroll like and then some's quite just typical times new roman style um but i like this opening you can see there's like a little tab here you pop your finger in there and then you can pull open the door which i really like so if you haven't seen i did the um makeup revolution advent calendar unboxing it's my last video that i did so go check that out um and it was really difficult to open the doors so that was so easy that was like so amazingly pleasing okay this this is really cute um this is i know i said earlier about they sometimes um maybe not rip off products but take a lot of inspiration from products and make something that's pretty much the same as something else this is a very good example of that so this is a um healthy glow retinal toner and this is 75 ml so straight away this is a good size um but i think some of you have probably figured out by now this is uh there's a brand called oh what's it called pixie is it just Pixie Beauty? My brain's gone blank. I absolutely adore it. There's a brand called Pixie. Pixie Beauty. I swear it is. Oh my God, why? Okay, yeah, anyway. And they literally have, um, because I use it, it's in my nighttime skin routine. I use it every single night. It is a retinal toner. And the packaging is spot on. <laughs> the packaging is exactly the same apart from the label. Their label, I think, is just white. Um, this is cruelty free, uh, produced in the UK. It is a healthy glow retinol toner. It's specially formulated with retinol and 5% niacinamide, revealing rejuvenated skin and helping to reduce the appearance and signs of skin aging. Um, suitable for normal skin, suitable for vegetarians and vegans. Yeah, I use this every night um, on my skin. It's a multi-action toner, retinol and jasmine flower. Um, but this is cute though, cause I can actually try this and see what's better. It's a cute little size. Um, it's a really good size for an advent calendar actually because it's not super small. It's 75 mil, so it's a fairly decent size. Um, and that's gonna last you a fair while. So I'm gonna give that a go and I'm gonna see how it fares with my uh, Pixie one. But that's the first one. So that's fantastic. I am really happy with that. So number 27. This is a golden glow mask for all skin types. Um, this is 50 ml, so this is really good. This is it. Apply it to your face, uh, leave on 15 minutes, and then rinse off with warm water. So like standard mask, but 50 ml. This is this is like fantastic size. This is the mask. Um, it is just a gold. It kind of looks like banana um, mousse or something actually, but it smells a bit the the the. <laughs> The only issue I find with some Lacura Aldi beauty products is that a lot of them contain, well not a lot of them, but some of them contain perfume, which obviously perfume can irritate your skin. Um, I am quite lucky I've used that mask and I've not had any problems. Obviously, if you are do have very sensitive skin, just be careful. If you do want to try it out, do a patch test first because you don't want to, you know, make yourself have a breakout or rash or anything, so be very careful. Um, and obviously check the ingredients before you use anything just to make sure what's in there. I'm very funny with that. This smells very, I think this must have perfume in, I feel like, but it does smell very, it smells like kitchen cleaner. It does. It smells really nice to me because I love, when I clean my kitchen, I love the smell of it. But it might not be nice to some other people. The other one didn't smell like this, I don't think, so it might just be this little pot. It's not like super in your face. Oh my God, it's only when I'm like right here, like proper sniffing to try and smell something so i don't think that would be a problem when it's on your skin i don't think it would be like overwhelming but obviously if you are someone who doesn't like fragrance that just is something to be mindful of um but i'm definitely going to give that a go that's really yeah i love if you know me you know i love my masks um so no i'm really happy with it. so number 28 is very big it's the biggest one here 
and it's just this door here it's a very big door so this is really cool because the, the first thing that was on top was this it's like a muslin cloth you know that material like that muslin material it's like very um i can't describe it it's very like uh, i don't know coarse kind of cloth that you use on your face i'm terrible at describing things um but so that was on first and then this this is a pink clay hot cloth cleanser so i'm guessing that's why you've got this cloth with it um gently cleanses and exfoliates to reveal naturally healthy looking skin 75 ml um skincare with bamboo macadamia mangosteen and pomegranate extracts so that's really nice one thing i like i like the packaging like this is really nice packaging this doesn't feel like cheap typical plastic packaging it actually feels quite nice um so again cruelty free um for skin types suitable for sensitive skin yes with the help of the exfoliating muslin cloth uh, with cocoa butter pink clay australian cacao dew plum and extracts of bamboo um, the rich formulation effectively removes makeup and gently cleanses with really naturally healthy skin so you apply some to dry skin and gently massage into your face and neck rinse your cloth um, in hand hot water and wring out any excess then place the cloth over your face to open pores before gently polishing off the cleanser Ah, then rinse the cloth thoroughly during cleansing finish by splashing your face with cool water to close pores and pat your face dry with a towel let the muslin cloth dry naturally after each use oh no that's really cool because it's it's like the actual two things you know it's like it's a duo that's how you use it so they've given you the tools to do that i really like that because a lot of stuff you get is like oh yeah use this with this use this with this but they don't give it you so then you have to go out of your way and spend more money so i really like that muslin cloths aren't like super expensive but i really like that that's in there as well um no i'm excited to try that i don't really deal with like cleansers and stuff like this but this seems like really interesting i don't know if you can see it's just it's got like a pink tinge to it it kind of just looks like a thick cream mask to be honest um but no i'm quite excited to try that to be fair again it's like it's kind of like a mask but it's not and I, I like the fact that it's not just a cleanser i like the fact that you've got the cloth as well to do like something a bit more specific um i like i feel like there's a bit more thought behind that i can't really smell anything doesn't really smell like anything <laughs> so number 29 um, this is another this is um in the same kind of component as the mask um it's basically in a little pot um, 50 ml this is a gentle facial moisturizer this is in a purple color that matches um, the actual advent calendar itself yeah so it's just in a 50 ml um, little pot the face mask was in a pot as well but it was a gold pot it's got the same style and logo on the front just says la cura skincare for you gentle facial moisturizer um, directions after cleansing a massage onto face and neck one thing I do notice there is no like seals or anything on any any of the products um, which doesn't really bother me because I know they're coming from in an advent calendar kind of thing but I know some people might like a little cover on their mask because sometimes you get the plastic lids that you can just pop on and off and then um, for like the cleanser you know like the little foil things that they go on there isn't one of them and um, it doesn't really bother me but if I was buying it in a shop and it was out of the box because then I might be like, has someone used it? But not really an issue. This has an ever, I've just got it on my nose. This has an ever such a slight, an ever such a slight, yeah. This has a slight smell to it. I can't tell what it is, but it's literally like the bare minimum smell. Um, It looks a little bit empty, I'm going to be honest. It's kind of, it's not full to the brim. And then even then it's on a bit of a bit crooked, you can see there. There's like a bit of a dip to it um so it is meant to be 50 mil but to be fair there's still a lot of product in there um and for 15 quid for everything i don't really mind um i'm gonna put some on the back of my hand oh it's very um i don't want to say creamy because that's stupid but it's very thick so it's just white 
it's very well actually it's weird it's thick but then when you blend it out it kind of feels like it's water based it feels like it's water based it's not oily it's not sticky oh yeah no i can smell it a bit more now it smells very it smells ever so slightly like the tiniest bit mentholy do you know when you get like mints and that ever so slightly it's gone now ever so slightly but i like that that's really nice that's really soft it's not sticky right we've only got two left so let's go on to the 30th this is actually huge um this is a healthy glow rose oil nourishing face oil um with rose and pomegranate pomegranate oils um now this is 25 ml this is a really big um bottle it's one of those bottles that's got like the dropper on so you squeeze it at the top it picks the product up in the little the glass dropper and then this is um it's a plastic it's yeah it's a is it it's a i think this is glass i think this is glass or really 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 fancy plastic that looks like glass um the packaging is like on point i can't really complain it's like this is heavy as well this is like the packaging feels really nice the bottle does um and the bottles are really pretty pink color with a rose gold lid and a white pipette thing at the top you know that you squeeze and get the product out of um it's got the same label as the toner but this one's just got like the pink background on it instead of purple so it just says the cura skincare for you healthy glow rose oil after cleansing and toning massage two or three drops into your skin or add one to two drops to your moisturizer before applying for extra hydration oh i've never thought that i thought to put it in like foundations and that but never to put it in like moisturizer so that might be good for you oils are good for anyone really i have combination skin and i use an oil before bed just put three drops in my hand ever so slightly you can smell that kind of like rose kind of um yeah it feels nice it's definitely just oh yeah the more you rub it in you can smell that rose it's not super strong though and it's no it's not uncomfortable at all i like that they're all very like subtle smells um the mask was probably the most fragrant i like that everything about it is just really well packaged as well you know it, it doesn't look cheap you look at it and you think no it looks decent oh it doesn't look like high end but it looks nice yeah but an oil's great to put um i use it as the last step in my skincare routine of a night time because if you put an oil on last after you've done like your serum your foundation and everything pat it on your skin last it's going to make everything stay in there some people put their oil on and their moisturizer the moisturizer is kind of just going to sit on top of the oil and slide around and not really do anything for your skin so definitely if you have dry or even combination skin a good oil pat it on your face i'm currently using the makeup revolution uh, cbd oil um which is really good because i have really acne prone skin i get really red hyperpigmentation and all that it's really good and it's really helping to kind of calm my skin down especially at night time when your skin is like the most um rejuvenating that's not the word regenerating that's the word um yeah when your skin's like when you're asleep and your skin naturally just regenerates um but anyway happy new year we're on to the 31st which isn't technically the new year because it's still december but we're just gonna roll with it okay this is the only thing i can say that i'm annoyed about because it is a beauty advent calendar for me i feel like there's no need for this right so this is <laughs> the last one um this is a eau de toilette um which is a bit weird because an eau de toilette is basically um a less fragrant perfume so if you've got an eau de parfum that lasts more the smells look stronger and it lasts more throughout the day an eau de toilette is something that isn't as fragrant and isn't going to last as long but this is 15 mil it's a really good size um it's a nice black bottle it's like a long rectangular black glass bottle it has a round gold lid on this is number 10 it just says it's number 10 i'm guessing that's um fragrance number 10 and it says bitter orange now i don't mind fragrances i don't mind getting fragrances at all but i feel like in a beauty advent calendar personally i just don't feel like it fits that well oh no actually that is nice you know what that is like a nut this is gonna sound weird it's like a nice men's perfume but at the same time it's not like masculine like i think if you're male female anything you could wear this 
this is just a very like unisex fragrance which i really like it reminds me it smells very similar to what my partner wears i think that's why the first thing i said was it's very like like a men's fragrance but it's definitely got that hint of sweetness as well you can definitely it smells like fresh orange but it doesn't just smell like fresh orange it smells really nice and it's like a spicy one but at the same time it's sweet that's really nice this is perfect bag size as well or you can keep it in your car you can keep it in your bag literally this is great to pop in your bag i love having fragrance in my bag um how many times did i say bag then sorry that's so nice it is literally a mixture it's like sweet but it's spicy it's not super sweet it's not super like you know when you smell like links and you're like oh that's a bit like oh, not rough but like very full it's not that full but it's nice it's a bit spicy but it's a bit sweet you can smell the orange in it if that made any sense to anyone i applaud you but that is everything we've got in the advent calendar guys so i am really happy everything is really good size i will use everything um everything's really well thought out the packaging's really nice looking um for 15 pounds you cannot complain i would go to your aldi if you want this for yourself definitely grab it because there's stuff here that can go it's not just for like a certain it's not like for a younger person or an older person i think literally anybody can use this because it works on any kind of skin um if you're just into your skincare or want to look after yourself a bit more i definitely recommend it but everything's a really good size so you can definitely give it a go and then i'm guessing they sell everything like this singular if you get your hands on it i think they have them at the minute so definitely give them a go and then if you want to pop back and grab some stuff um go for it but that is all i've got for you today guys um thank you so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed this video if you have any questions or comments please just leave them down below yeah let me know your thoughts um are you going to grab this for someone do you already have it um are you really looking forward to it now are you just let me know your thoughts you know are you going to grab it for a friend you're going to grab it for yourself do let me know um and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified whenever i upload a video um and i have got my fab fit fun unboxing coming very soon because that should be nearly on its way i've got another glossy box unboxing coming soon and then we've got all sorts of stuff thank you so much for watching guys i really do appreciate it i hope you enjoy the rest of your day evening whatever you're doing and i will see you in my next video so take care guys bye